Hi, this is Bailey with Antiquaria, and today I'm going to give you a really quick demonstration about getting started with your calligraphy kit. It's really simple once you see how. So you've got a pen. This is a pen. It does not have the nib in it yet. Mine is much dirtier than yours from use, but that's okay. It doesn't affect anything. What I normally do is hold it in my left hand and then you take the nib and this can be kind of tricky especially with a new pen this flange can be really tight so don't hesitate to use a little force to get it in there because that can be necessary you can even go in there with pliers and make the opening just at, judge it open a little bit more if you're having a really hard time with it So you hold it with your left hand and you just push it in with your right hand. Again, take some force, don't be afraid of that. And let the, let the nib hang out the back a little bit. You can adjust this depending on when, you, you know, when, once you practice and get comfortable, you can decide do you like it pushed really down, is this comfortable in your hand, how your letter forms with that, you can push it the other way. Is it better to have a longer nib? Do you like that better? I push it hmm, till about there. So now your pen is ready to go. Now you'll just need to get your ink. Again, same ink, just bigger bottle. You'll put it in, in your holder. It's a little clear glass holder. And once that's in there, you just have to dip it in. I usually, especially if it's a new nib, just kind of get it flowing through. At first it can be a little tricky or not want to flow correctly, but it looks like this one's pretty good. So then I usually start with some practice strokes to get it warmed up and to get it flexible because like the pen holder, the nibs can be tight as well when they're brand new. So I just go down and up and down and up and down and up. And this is a really good exercise as well for practicing your pressure and release. You could do thick lines down thin lines up, thick lines down, whatever works. I mean, just get comfortable with it, get comfortable with holding it. It can definitely feel like a foreign object at first, but I promise that it'll get more and more and more comfortable and you won't have as many problems once it feels comfortable in your hands. I remember it being very difficult at first because it just, it was not like holding a pencil or a ballpoint pen. So you can also look at doing circles if you want. It's a little bit trickier, but like a good way to a good way to practice those, especially if you're gonna make an O. Very similar. Definitely the 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 best best place to start is this up and down. Down is pressure, up is light. Down is pressure, up is light. This right here, basis of all the letter forms, every last stick in one of them. So I hope this helps with getting started with your calligraphy kit and your calligraphy lettering practice. Of course, we're here to answer any questions, so feel free to email us. Check out our website at www.shopantiquaria.com. And we hope you love calligraphy as much as we do.